Hello YouTube, my name is Ajaj Patel and I am from webhub.blogspot.com. Welcome to the part 3 of e-commerce website development in PHP with PDO. In this tutorial, we will learn uh, how to create some important folders for our website. But, bef uh, but before we do that, we need one server because the PHP is a server-side scripting language, so we need a uh, we need to execute PHP code then we need one server so go to your google.com okay and type vamp server okay guys look at here here is the official website of vamp server then click on it Okay, our website is open now. Now scroll down and here is the one option download. Okay guys, the, uh, so you can download VAM server for your 64 bit operating system or 32 bit operating system. Okay, my system is 64 bit. Uh, you want to check your system then go to computer and right click it and go to property. Okay guys, observe here, here is your operating system 64 bit. If your operating system 32 bit, then you can download this or 86, uh, or 86 bit, then you can also download this. Okay guys, so I already download a web server, so and I also install it, so go to your my computer and go to C drive and find the VAM folder look at here, here is this click on it and here is the one folder up here here www which means in this folder our all projects are saved ok guys so simply just right click it and Okay, here it is. Send to desktop. Okay, now close it. Here is our web server folder is available here. Okay, guys. Now open it. Okay. Look at here. Here are some website which is already created by me. Royal Shop Tricks, uh, tricks and Tips. Okay, then now we will create a folders for our new website which is like uh, online store. Okay guys, go to our folder. Click on new folder and give the name like CSS. It contain all the CSS file of our website. Create one another folder and give the name image images it contain all the images which is in our website okay then again click on new folder and create one js folder it contain all the javascript files in this folder okay then click on new folder and create one more uh, folder like web pages okay it contain all the web pages of our website then again click on new folder and create one more folder which is like include inc short form okay guys so our folders are created okay but uh, we need one more folder like admin okay guys this folder is for admin only and this folder for our user side okay so just simply copy this all by control c and uh, inside admin paste it again okay but in admin we don't need a image folder so we will delete this okay guys now go to your uh, browser and first of all start the web server by clicking it I say yes okay start it observe here 
here is our web server is starting but wait for its green signal okay waiting for green signal green signal is coming soon come on come on okay guys green signal is coming now go to your browser simply go to your browser and in URL type local host and hit enter okay so it will open local host server okay look at here your projects we have one uh, some projects like uh, royal shop tricks and dip and look at here we create this project right uh, we uh, create this project online store okay so how can we run this project so simply click on it online server but uh, look at here here are the directories available which is our folders so guys this is about how to run our website on browser so guys in next tutorial we will create our index page and design our website so guys stay tuned with me and if you like my videos then comment share and subscribe uh, uh, share my videos and if guys don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel because it is very benefit for you for latest update of my channel so guys stay connected with me see you in next tutorial thanks for watching goodbye